guys! I thought I'd do a bit of a different video today instead of it being book related. I'm going to do an updated what's in my bag video. I'm using this bag, which is a Susie Smith messenger bag, or satchel, whatever. Um, it's been about three years, I think, since I did, last did my what's in my bag video, so I thought I'd update it. Um, so this is my bag. I got it from TK Maxx about £30. I like how small it is. It's got an adjustable strap, which I really like. And yeah, so let's get started. There's a pocket on the back, which I usually keep for my phone, but I've left that downstairs. Um, this is Sexy Mother Pucker Gloss Stick in Nudist, which is in the back. And I love the colour. Um, I've also got my keys with um, my little club cards, Sainsbury's, Pets at Home and Tesco, and a uh, torch. And that's everything in the back pocket. So the main compartment, um, just show you quickly in there, there's another zip pocket and there's two little pockets on the inside, which is a really one of the reasons why I really like this bag, it's lots of different bits and pieces with it. So first thing out are my um, sunglasses with my prescription lenses from Specsavers. I really love these, I got these last October and I've been really enjoying wearing them this summer. And I like the hard case too. My wallet, purse, whatever, um, which is from Radley, which uh, Ryan's dad got me a couple of years ago. I really like how small and compact it is. Just some Rangham in there and some gift cards from when we got our new house. And then there's just lots of cards in there and no money. <laughs> so that's that. Then I've also got a foldable shopping bag. This is um, from Paper Chase. Um, I've got a dotty one as well, but I've left that downstairs because I used that earlier today when I went out to buy some milk and stuff. Um, I love this one because it's got a little smiley face on it and it can get quite big, so I like that. What else? I've also got um, a stripy umbrella because it rains a lot in, the, uh, in England, but also up north it rains a lot more than it did down south actually no that's not true in Plymouth it rained a lot and it rains a lot in Hull too but this is from Accessorize and it's an ultra slim light one and I really like this because it doesn't wear my handbag down and the last thing we have in the middle compartment the main pocket of my bag is this cute little um clouds case which I originally had a contact lens case in there but since I've stopped wearing contact lenses I took the case out and I've just got my little headphones in there some purple ones that my other half got me. So that's everything in the middle and so I'm going to do the zip pocket. I've got some tissues, I've got some Mentos mints, um, I've got a Nivea lip butter in raspberry rose and I really like if I can get into it because it's new still. I like the smell anyway, I can't bother to get, try and get into it. Then I've got a multicoloured Acer pen which was a freebie from one of the conferences my other half went to a couple of years ago. It's just red, black and blue, pretty simple and handy. Then the two inside pockets I've got left. The first one is um, a cute little um, tickets please That's what card holder that I got from my best friend. So inside I just have my rail card, so yeah, and on the other side I just have um, some other gift card things. I've got um, a works card, which is a cheap bookshop in the UK, I've got a Visa gift card that we got for Christmas, which has only got a couple of quid left on it, and we've got a um, Subway card that I used to use quite a lot when we lived in Plymouth, but not so much since we've moved. Then on to the last pocket, oh no, there's something else still in this one. I've got a 
um, British Heart Foundation gift aid a gift card um, with my donor ID and stuff on the back just for you know when I go and donate um, books that I don't want I generally just go take them to charity shops instead of trying to sell them and um, other bits and pieces like clothes and stuff then I've got a cute <laughs> little um, mirror from my friend Krista that's um, Mickey and Minnie kissing it's a bit dirty though then my last pocket I have a I think it's just chocolate chip cereal bar but in case I get peckish um, I've got a little um, kabuki brush from I can't remember where it's from now um, uh, eco tools I think it's from in boots there's a little package of like loads of little brushes and I've got that in there because sometimes I keep powder in there but I don't have any in there today and then I have my favourite thing ever which is the forehead balm for when you get headaches it's just like a menthol balm but um, it's also non-greasy and colourless but I get a lot of headaches especially in the summer due to the heat and everything and I pretty much got sick of popping painkillers all the time um, I had headaches and it's, I just don't think it's good for your stomach and I just don't think it's good for you as well because when you do end up getting hurt or something you've got to actually take painkillers they just don't seem to be as effective if you take them on a regular occurrence because of headaches or whatever so I use that and I just I love the smell, it's so mentally there's not much left though it's nearly all used up but I love the smell but these have like, I've been using these since I was about 16 or something um, when someone, a lady at my first job um, lent me hers and they're really handy but they're so expensive now they used to be like just under four pounds and now they think like nearly six pounds or something and the last thing I've got in my bag is um, a travel owl you know those mini spritzer things perfume holders and it's got um, the body shop sheer spray in it and I love that so that's everything that's in that bag. Like I say, I normally have my phone in the back pocket, but that's downstairs at the moment and I completely forgot to bring it up. And yep, yeah, that's everything complete.